Uh, good afternoon, everyone. Uh, I'll be presenting about evaluation of ocular anterior segment changes in pregnancy using sheen plug technology. Can you come closer to the mic, Dr. Ashton? Go closer to the mic. So in pregnancy, uh, most of the uh, body organ system undergo changes, and it also includes the eye. Uh, and uh, these changes are mostly due to a raise in uh, um, hormone levels like estrogen, progesterone, and beta HCG. Corneal epithelium and stroma uh, have estrogen and progesterone receptors, and these are the not mic. spared. Go closer to the mic. Yeah. And these are not spared from um, corneal ectasia changes. Literature has reported many other changes uh, like decrease in IOP, increase in ACA, ACV, ACD, and also changes in corneal density and thickness during pregnancy. So this study uh, helps to compare the changes between the early and late stages of pregnancy in normal South Indian population. So the three main objectives of this study are to observe the changes in topographic measurements of cornea and anterior chamber, to observe the changes in densitometric measurements of cornea, and also to observe the changes in intraocular pressure during the course of pregnancy. So this is a, a prospective case control study with 31 healthy pregnant women as cases and 31 healthy non-pregnant women as controls within the age group 20 to 40 years. All the patients have underwent routine ophthalmological examination, including the uh, sheen plug imaging. So the results are the uh, mean age of uh, cases is 24 years, and the mean age of controls is 26 years. And the best corrected visual acuity of uh, cases and controls is 6 by 6. On comparison of mean corrected IOP, there's a significant decrease uh, in, uh, of IOP by 3 mm Hg in pregnant women uh, by third trimester. Uh, regarding the mean K1 and K2, there is no significant uh, difference between the groups uh, and also there is no significant change in K1, uh, in K1 or K2 uh, at uh, first and second, uh, th third trimester. On comparison of changes in central corneal thickness, there is a statistical significant increase in corneal thickness was seen in pregnant women compared to control group in the first visit. Um, and the corneal volume showed a statistical significant increase at both first and third trimester. Uh, the corneal density has no uh, significant changes uh, during, uh, in both cases and controls during the first and third trimester. Among anterior chamber depth, angle, and volume, the anterior chamber angle and anterior chamber volume has shown statistically significant increase in third trimester of pregnancy. On uh, performing various correlation analysis, um, there is a statistical significant correlation between intraocular pressure and corneal volume, intraocular pressure and CCT, and corneal density uh, and uh, corneal volume. The mean age of cases was 24 years, and the study population had a BCVA of 6 by 6. The corneal curvature did not show any changes in pregnancy, and the uh, mean IOP has significantly decreased by 3 mm Hg, which can be due to decrease in scleral rigidity, uh, episcleral pressure, and also an increase in aqueous outflow. The corneal thickness changes can be attributed to the hypoosmolar state of cornea due to action of estrogen and progesterone on the corneal epithelium, stroma, and endothelial cells. Due to the hormonal influence during pregnancy, there is a significant increase in anterior chamber volume and anterior chamber angle, and also associated with a decrease in intraocular pressure. On conclusion, there is a significant uh, ocular anterior segment changes were observed in our study. As pregnancy is a physiological state, these changes should be carefully evaluated before treating diseases like progression of myopia, keratoconus, or glaucoma. The pathological effect of these changes can only be understood with its continued study post-pregnancy with larger sample size as well as the longer follow-up studies.